Good morning. Okay, I'm going to do a full day of eating for today's vlog. Uh, first meal is breakfast. So I just went for my hour walk. Um, I get up, uh, you know, before, about an hour before breakfast every morning. I do an audio book um, for an hour or so. Uh, I was listening to a key person of influence this morning, a uh, business book. Yeah, it's not not too bad, about two hours into it. Um, so I've just got my breakfast made. Um, I've used my Amex Isoprime as my chocolate protein. Um, and what I do is, and I did this in a video last week, is I mix it up re really, really thick. Um, and then I put it into the freezer, put some blueberries in on top of it. Um, and then I leave it in the freezer just to kind of go, you know, so it's really, really cold. And then I mash it all up so it's like ice cream texture. Um, and then I've got, you know, 75 grams of porridge oats. Um, again, organic oats. It doesn't really matter which ones you use. I use the organic ones just because I know that there's not going to be pesticides and shit in the uh, in the oat fields that it's made in, um, which obviously means your gut will have less dig less issues digesting it if it doesn't have to deal with the pesticides. Um, but yeah, that's me at one. I have this every single morning. The only thing that changes is the amount of, of oats I eat. Um, so if I've been training pretty crazy with legs the day before, legs that day, you know, I'll do 75 grams. Otherwise, I'll do you know, 50 grams. Um, and then the last thing I chuck in is flaxseed oil. I chuck it in on top. Um, again, flaxseed oil is amazing. Omega-3s, again, I've got my supplementation routine in the morning, which is like my um, vitamin B, vitamin C, vitamin D, um, and my multivitamin, I take them first thing. Um, and I also take the, again, I was telling somebody about this yesterday, uh, sterine. it's a neurotransmitter for the brain, so it helps, uh, it helps with those neurotransmitters. Basically, if you think of your brain like pathways, um, it helps like build those build roadblocks um, or build those roads that allow the, the pathways to be clearer. Um, so I take that every morning. So that's meal one. Um, so next one's going to probably be a pre-workout meal. So I'll record that next um, and then we'll hit the okay, gym. Yeah, I missed the pre-workout meal because I actually go run errands in the car. So basically it was just turkey and oats and a shake. Uh, en route to the gym now, uh, going doubling up with Paul. So. Paul, head trainer, the guy, he does all the one-to-ones for Branky Fitness um, in the Galway City area. So we're going to hit our training session now. I'm going to record that. Uh, so check it out. Uh, so we recorded the whole workout on Snapchat. So Brian K019, the whole thing was live. Um, it was a giant hit to start. I'll put it in the description. So uh, dumbbell flat flies uh, with dumbbell bench press and then straight into cables with like a twist at the top to hit the inside um, of the pec. So you can see that twist. Um, and then... Uh, kind of a flat hammer uh, again. We couldn't use any fucking weight on this because uh, I was at my chest was just toast. We did uh, three sets on that, but I'll put the whole description link in the description. Um, then we did lap pull downs with a hammer grip and um, to kind of focus on the inside of the back um, and, and just the outside of the lat. Um, Super set with a rear delt raise on the uh, on the fly machine. Um, and then the tricep finished with a, a low row. Again, as you can see, I've got 10 kilos either side of this. So like, it's about how hard you squeeze the muscle. Um, and then just to finish it out, uh, I did literally body weight squats. Uh, so I did like four sets of 25, so 100 reps in total. And then uh, body weight lunges, just 25 reps on each side, four sets total. Okay, meal three. Um, again, nothing too crazy. Turkey mince um, and 100 grams of basmati rice post-workout. Um, and if you look, I've just got my spices here. Uh, curry powder, mild curry, Chinese spice, and, and cayenne powder. Any of those, really. Um, whatever your favorite kind of spices and herbs are, put them over your rice, over your chicken, cook them in it. Um, and it just kind of makes boring food a little bit better. I'm, again, a pretty boring eater. I can eat anything plain, um, but the flavors and spices do help. Um, so that's okay, post-workout so for meal. today's vlog. Um, thanks again for watching, guys. Uh, Sorry I didn't get to do the whole full day. Today has just been nuts. Um, my program's launching again next week, my top 50, and I have my the current top 50 are moving into their second phase. Um, so I've been trying to get everything in order for that. So again, stay tuned next week. The guys that have been in the top 50 are the guys and girls have been crushing it. So I have a couple of testimonies and uh, and befores and afters coming next week. Um, and then I'm launching the top 50 for another group. So the first 50 people to sign up. Um, it's basically online personal training um, where I do, uh, you get the program, the nutritional plan, and then I track it in a Facebook group for six weeks and I do weekly Q and A's, answer questions, uh, and kind of build up a community in that group. Um, again, the ones that have been doing it, this time round have been absolutely amazing. So looking forward to getting the next top 50 up and running and getting the current top 50 into the next phase. Um, so again, 
I'm going to do a full day of eating next week. I'm linking up with Clean Cut Meals next week, um, so I'm getting their food, so it won't be as uh, as boring as today's meal, because uh, those boys are absolutely awesome over there. They're killing it. Um, again, I'll have the macros and stuff. I don't track macros. If you've seen my rant on my Fitness Pal video, you, you'll see, but uh, I kind of have a good gauge of what the macros are from just looking at food. Again, use my Fitness Pal like a fucking instruction manual. Use it for a couple of days and then chuck it in the bin. Um, so I'll do that next week and track all the clean cut meals. Um, but again, thanks for watching, guys. Again, like and subscribe if you haven't. If you've got any questions or any comments of what you want me to do or where I can, I can improve or what will help with the videos, put them in the comments down below because I read and try and reply to all of them. So thanks again for watching, guys. I'll come at you tomorrow with another vlog.